Hey, it's Liz with Big Tex Worms. I'm doing a little experiment. Um, as you, if you've watched any of my videos, you know that I, rec I recommend a certain type of bedding. And I talk about um, new worm farmers' mistakes using the wrong bedding being the number one mistake. So I thought I'd do a little test because it's been a long time since I used bad bedding in a bin. Um, so what I did was I had a bin that had a lot of really small worms. So I took all the small worms and I put them over here on the side in some bedding, you know, just with their bedding from their bed. And then this is just a 10 gallon Rubbermaid tote. And then I took the whole, so that's got about a third of a pound of worms. And then this side over here is just nothing but leaves and straw and maybe some dirt that I just grabbed from my bedding around where my goats are. So there is some goat manure in there, but look at that bedding. To me as a worm farmer, that just looks terrible. It's so coarse and dry. So I'm d I just wet it down pretty good. It's sticking to my hands. It's wet. And then I've got these worms over here. And my plan is just to um, pretty much just make sure that this stays wet or moist and not feed them at all and just see what happens because theoretically bedding is food right so we'll we'll test my recommendation and see how the worms do um but the difference that a lot of people do is they would add food with this which is bad bedding and number two overfeeding because this is food you know they have to really they're going to take forever to work on this so i'm anxious to see if these tiny worms um grow and uh, I'm anxious to see if, um, if how they do but you see most of the worms are this size let's see if you can see this worm right here see they're small so keep you posted